so we're at a new location today. We're just going to give it a little bit of a test. And so far, we've been distance from my car to here. We just have a little 10 cent piece. Just under the surface, been there for a while. So, initially, it looks promising. So, we'll give this a real going over today. So, we just finished the uh, bark area for Zifty Doodah. Kind of expected, most people hit the bark areas. I like hitting the, the dirt and the grass. So, just about two minutes off the bark area, we have an old five cent piece. So now to do the rest. So we slug it away, working our way down the fence line, lots of aluminium, lots of steel. But we come across a decent signal and it's a 20 cent piece. 19... 73. Fair way down. There is another signal there, but I don't think it's corn light. We'll scan over it and find out though. Okay, so we have another 16 down here for another 20 cent piece. This one is 1994. So we had a high 26, 27. You guessed it. 20 cent piece. It's a good neck for what it is. Oh, so I had a low to mid 20, 25, jumping around a little bit, and I've been a little one cent piece, fair way down. Okay, so I'll take a signal, and it looks like a really old button. Tell you too old. Little pattern on it, so we'll clean it up later. So we have a little detecting buddy. Oh, there he goes. Well that was a battle. From this section here, I had to dig five separate holes. So they're a little bit messy. But we've got five five cent pieces. <sighs> that was hard going. So just come over here and we've got a little surface find. Ah. Little five cent piece sitting on the surface. Hard going for a little one cent piece. Not very far down either. Just under the grass line or weed line. About time. We should have done a coin. Been there for a long time. Oh, maybe there's something more in this park. I don't know, but. My bag is half full of trash. Okay, so that's one deep hole. There's my spade. It's a fair way down, so the pinpointer straight down. But uh, it was a money spill. $2.40. We got 2001. 2004 and 1983. Hard going, but well worth it. So I had a very scratchy turn, and uh, I dug him up, and it was a 10 cent piece. Right in there. Not sure the year. Oh, it's another New Zealand one. <laughs> No one likes New Zealand coins, but look at it. Oh, and something else fell out of the plug. Oh, didn't see that one before. Another 10 cent piece. <laughs> Two of them. Okay, so I had another iffy signal. It looked like a, a 15, 16. It happened to be two cruddy 20 cent pieces. Not sure what the date is. So there's been a lot, of, seems to be a lot of coin spills around here. Unknown date. Don't that wavies. And unknown date. Oh, keep going. So this signal was a faint 1920. As you can see, it's a fair way down. Like most of the stuff here seems to be fair whack under. It's been there for a while. 
So it is a 1992 $2 coin. Uh, so it's five bucks a day for uh, uh, about an hour's work. It's not too bad. So another plug, another 20 cent piece. <laughs> 1617 for another 20 cent piece. All coming out red. <laughs> it's very soft ground, but it's also very clay like. It looks like it's been a lot of topsoil because these things are under a fair way. So, keep on going. We have a really scratchy 20, 19, 18, 24, 26. I thought, yeah. And, have to be a $1 coin. Been there for a while. Can't even see the date on it. 19 something. No, still good. So a little bit of a dig down, just for a little two cent piece. Been there for a long time. Not too far down though, compared to the rest of the coin, Daddy. It's hard digging a plug in the clay, but. You try the best you can. Make sure it looks nice and neat. And of course, step on it. Right beside that two cent piece, which is right there. I thought I had another signal when I waved over to begin with. And down here, there's another two cent piece. You can see where it was. Oop, trying to get back in the hole. And behind me, I reckon I've got another signal as well. So I'll go investigate that. So 21.22, right on the surface, didn't even need a dig for a dollar coin. What have we got? 1996. 